a potato. Welcome, welcome, welcome everybody to another video of me being in the middle of nowhere lost. Traveled 30 miles down a dirt road. Google, I thought was actually getting me lost. They weren't. Some other trucks are here already. I am in the middle of North Dakota picking up at a little farm. Potatoes going from North Dakota all the way down to Lakeland, Florida. It's going to be a journey and an adventure. And it already started by traveling down this long, desolate road. When we leave here, got to head off into the sunset like cowboys on horses, except in my case, we'll be in a truck. Definitely weird to think that, man, there are still roads in the United States that go on for miles and miles and miles and miles that are just dirt. And they're major streets. This is a major street. All right, it, it, I mean, it's a street and it has a street number and uh, it goes all the way down to South Dakota. It's just one long dirt road. And I'd like to get out of here before the sun sets so we can kind of see ourselves crossing the border seeing, welcome to South Dakota on a dirt road. Something not everybody gets to witness. Well, we are definitely no longer in North Dakota. The grass is definitely greener here. If we're back in Metropolis, Illinois, and something's going on around the Superman statue. A long time ago, over the years, now this has nothing to do with the Superman Museum brick project, but they are removing all the bricks and adding new bricks that were sold through the Chamber of Commerce. So if you guys have purchased bricks through the Chamber of Commerce, Instead of the Super Museum, this is where yours are going. And uh, they look good. I just don't know if I like it. I kind of like the older bricks that were here. These are the bricks you're going to want to purchase. That's where you purchase them from. Yeah, we uh, shot down from North Dakota, South Dakota, Missouri, into Illinois. And uh, we're stopping for lunch. It's been a long drive so far so we're gonna stop grab some lunch 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 at my favorite place in town to eat El Toro grab some tacos or I think I'm actually gonna go for something else other than tacos today not exactly sure I think for the last three years I've only eaten tacos man of steel has gone full what what's what's that what, what's, what's it called Q and uh, what what, what, what is that stuff called? I don't know what you're talking about. The uh, community. That community. Here, let me start over. Start down here. Uh, the gay community. What's that called? Weird? No, but the, everything. Oh, the whole thing together. Oh, LGBTQ? Yeah, yeah. Look at Superman. Gone LBGTQ, whatever it is. How awesome. So you're going to get a selfie? A selfie. Well, I can stand back here and do it for you. No, you oh my God, she thinks I'm the worst photographer ever. Yeah. And you know what? She's probably right. A blows, we did all this walking because I have to park my truck about four blocks down. It's Sunday. I never, I didn't even know that some of the businesses were closed on Sundays. That kind of is terrible. Well, I was all excited. She got me excited for tacos. I mean, it doesn't take much to get me excited for tacos. Because we can't have tacos, we're going for the next best thing. Steaks, maybe, maybe, maybe steaks? I don't know. Probably a pork chop for me because pork they chop. make a heavenly pork chop. Either pasta or salmon for me. Not, not exactly that. Definitely not tacos. So we are sitting inside Bridges Steakhouse in Harris Casino in Metropolis, Illinois, waiting for our fantastic food to get here. Though Steph stuck in a truck, did she got me excited about tacos? But I, I, I was excited. I know, I know. How often do you get excited for food? I'm, I'm being ignored. Holy 
cow. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, Are you going to explain the food? Am I explaining Alfredo? Explain the Alfredo. <laughs> explain the Alfredo. Oh, oh, that's right. Hold it on camera. Here, you got to do this. Explain it. How am I explaining it? I don't know. You're the... It's part of your know. job. Uh, not really. To explain not to the me. customer. Uh, okay, so it's Alfredo, uh, which is a cheese sauce with broccoli and mushrooms. Hold on. Is Alfredo a cheese sauce? Yes. I thought it was a cream sauce. Cream sauce with cheese in it. Yeah. It's a creamy, cheesy sauce. How Traditionally, it doesn't even have cream. Oh, this. That, this is what is what that? Explain that. Whiskey pork chop. How come she got something good and I got something terrible? Well, that was your fault. That's what you love. But look at this. Check this out. Look at this. I got a hidden Mickey. A hidden Mickey. Done eating. And uh, Mansion Mom is supposedly home from St. Louis for a day or so. Hopefully, she's there right now. Got her some pork chops fancy kind too like stuff stuck in a truck head all split and pretty looking gourmet gourmet pork chops run that over there and then we got to continue on and try and make orlando by 8 a.m that's the goal anyway special place means to you and me currently closed at the moment for refurbishment cleaning and repairs this is it right around two years ago I checked out this roadside attraction and I was inside and there was a little kitty with a broken leg inside the owners of this establishment found cat down here in this trees down in here with a bunch of barking dogs they broke her leg and she was up a tree she wasn't she was smaller than a can of tuna and uh, which she doesn't eat she doesn't eat tuna for some reason strange cat i know but uh they brought her in had her inside the museum for about two weeks and cat had already made that her palace her home and then i walked in to check out roadside attractions. That was a day that changed my life. So not only was this cat's birthplace, it was the birthplace of our friendship. Okay, that's dorky. Guys, that's the type of videos you get. No, this is how you make a no content content video. Thanks for tuning in. I love you all and I'll see you on the next one. Hopefully with more amazing stories just like this. Peace out, everybody.